chest did not want to work. So there will be no... Oh well, I knew what the game. And... Listen to this cutscene that won't have subtitles. The human mind. 600 miles of synaptic fiber, five and a half ounces of cranial fluid, 1,500 grams of complex neural matter, a three-pound pile of dreams. But I'll tell you what it really is. It is the ultimate battlefield and the ultimate weapon. The wars of this modern age, the psychic age, are all fought somewhere between these damp, curvaceous undulations. From this day forward, you are all psychic soldiers, paranormal paratroopers. No we're gonna skip the cutscene. And we're gonna create a profile. And then after we create the profile, we will restart. We'll replay the clip. Uh, so. I'll replay the first cutscene, don't worry. Alright, settle down in here! Big day tomorrow! I want to see each and every one of you runs in my classroom at 0600 hours on the dot! I'm the early bird, and you're the worms. Got it? Now, lights out! Well, he's not very nice. And I'll have to do video editing. Lol. Okay, quick eye exam before we start. Huh? Look over that way, if you will. So, for those of you who... We're only within the no, generation that way. of Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Look this over there. is what we call... Uh, uh, what's over the there! I think it has something to do with, like, setting up controllers. Wow, what's that? Eight. Oh, that's a side challenge marker. The staff scatters these all over the camp to test the students. Every one of these you find advances you a whole rank. Uh-huh. Now look up for me, if you will. Oh, wait. Uh, no, I can't pause. Never mind. Hmm. No subtitles for this either. Some of the old markers have fallen apart. You'll find bits of them flapping around loose. If you find enough of these try cards, you can put them together to make a brand new challenge marker. But you have to buy a Psy core at the camp store to hold them together. Keep ranking up, and before you know it, You'll be able to use brand new psychic powers. Stuff you didn't even know you could do. And then when do I become a psychonaut? Because I have to do that before my dad shows up to take me home. Hey, where'd he go? That guy looks so familiar. Alright, so... Pretty sure what I can do is that. Not right. That's me coming up. Hey, Raz! Go. Hurry up! You don't want to be late for basic braining. Woohoo! Basic braining is the best class ever! Woohoo! All right, I'm gonna replay the first clip of the game. I really need to rename these tutorials. We will replay the human mind. 600 miles of synaptic fiber, five and a half ounces of cranial fluid, 1,500 grams of complex neural matter, a three pound pile of dreams. But I'll tell you what it really is it is the ultimate battlefield and the ultimate weapon. The wars of this modern age, the psychic age, are all fought somewhere between these damp, curvaceous undulations. 
From this day forward, you are all psychic soldiers, paranormal paratroopers, mental marines who are about to ship out on the adventure of their lives. This is our beachhead, and this is your landing craft. You shall engage the enemy in his own mentality. You shall chase his dreams. You shall fight his demons. You shall live his nightmares. And those of you who fight well, you will find yourselves on the path to becoming international secret agents. In other words, psychonauts. The rest of you will die. <laughs> Oh, Maury. Children, you are not going to die. Well, if you're not a psychonaut, then you might as well be dead. They told me this was a summer camp. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dogen. Don't worry about old Coach Oleander. I've been coming here for years, and trust me, nothing ever happens. Yeah, Dogen. Lily's right. You don't got nothing to worry about. Except for that giant monster in the lake I was telling you about. Bobby Zilch! I told you to stop scaring people with that ridiculous old legend. I don't want the kids to be afraid to go out at night and walk alone on the perfectly safe paths of Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp. And we don't want to scare our special guests, <clears throat> superstar psychonauts Sasha Nine and Mia Vodello. Introducing plot points one and two. Oh. And new character. Light monster! Formation. It's resisting. Quick, bring it over here. Is it? It's just a little boy. What's your name, darling? I'll find out. Get, get in. Ugh. My name starts with a D. Is Rasputin? Mm. You're wrong. But everybody calls me Ras. Love interest. Introduce. Please don't kill. Compelling. Armored like a tank. Sorry I'm late. I don't want to disrupt your briefing, Agent Oleander. Agents 9, Vodello, please, continue. Where do you think you're going? You've broken into a highly classified remote government training facility. I know. Isn't it great? Listen, why don't I just sit over here quietly with my fellow psychedets? Hey, how's it going? I like your hat. We need to have this young man taken from here immediately. I'll call his parents. Oh, what? don't call my parents. But don't you train psychonauts here? Yes, darling, but... To soar across the astral plane. To wage psychic warfare against the enemies of free thought. That is what I wrote on the front of the pamphlet. Those words are why I'm here, Coach Oleander. Do you remember what you wrote on the inside of that pamphlet? You were born with a special gift. But the people around you treat it like a curse. Your mother is afraid of you. And your father looks at you with shame in his eyes. Come to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp, and you can show them all. Back home, your powers make you a loner, an outcast, a circus freak. But in this dojo, in this psychic dojo, they make you a hero. Get that soldier a bunk. Now, darling, you can stay here for a few days until your parents come for you, but we can't let you participate in any paranormal training without your parents' consent. I'm sorry. Wowie, you're so lucky. You get to go home soon. Home? Back there, I was just like you were, Dogen. 
punished by my own family for having powers I never asked for. But here, I have a chance to be something, to make a difference. They may come for me, Dogen, but they'll be looking for Raz, the boy. What they're going to find, what they don't expect, is Raz, the Psychonaut. And, and, and then you'll make their heads explode? No. Do you do that? No. Well, once, kinda. But now I wear this special hat. Wanna try it on? No, no, no. But he has mental defenses like I've never seen in someone so young. If I could just get him in my lab for some experiments, I'm sure he could withstand more than the others. That kid's one in a million, Nine. But I'm not gonna let you turn him into one of your guinea pigs. I've got big plans for that mind. All right. That was the cutscene I had to skip because there were no subtitles. Alright, this. No collectible. We'll be everywhere. Yeah. I'm more than later. First. I'm telling you for the last time, no! I would never do that. I could never kill everyone. Oh! Hi, Raz. Squirrel trouble? They're liars is all. Whatever they tell you, it's a lie. I'll take your word for it. You going to class? Yeah, I'll meet you up there. As soon as they get these guys to shut up. God, he killed the squirrels. Oh, that has got to be the worst band name I have ever heard in the history of ever of all time. Eric, ever. Going, Maloof. Shh! I snuck out! That class is a death trap for crazy people! Listen, the coach is strong. At the start of class, he pulls you into his mind, and then there's nothing you can do about it. But once you're in, you can use these smelling salts to sneak out. Take mine. I don't need them anymore. I'm calling my parents to come get me before I get hurt. Too late! Bobby! Ah! Hey, kid! You owe me five arrowheads for this week's protection service. Cough it up, my loser, or you'll be coughing up bloody tears. Hey, leave him alone. I heard a rumor that you were raised in the circus. Well, let me put this in terms you'll understand. I'm the strong man around here. Really? Because you look more like the cotton candy. <laughs> Benny, put this kid dead on my to-do list. Come on, we'll see him in class. Yeah, we'll settle this on the battlefield. I was about to say we'll settle this in the arena, but I guess it's a better idea. What the fudge? She's spasming. <laughs> Why don't you take a... They see Nall be in a trance while they astrally project themselves into the coach's psyche. Which is awesome. Hey, Chloe. What are you doing? The coach uses this to broadcast his thoughts across the camp. I think I can tune it to reach my people in space. Your people in space? Are you an alien? 
Mmm, yeah, I can look at something. We've got goldfish in there. Mm. Oh. They see Nall being a trans yeah, while they... Sweet. They see Nall being a trans while they ask... Coach Oleander, I'm reporting for basic braining. Son, do you realize that to take my course, I will have to pull you into my mind, and you will have to relive every bullet-scarred memory of every battle I have ever faced. It won't be pretty. Are you sure you wouldn't rather run around a bit more in the sunshine first? I'm ready, I'm ready sir. Well then... I'm ready! You're late, soldier. Now get in here and give me 20. So, this is it. The mental world. It looks like a dentist office. A mental dentist office. It's a recruiting office, kids, and I'm here to recruit you for the greatest job in the world, being a psychonaut. It's about fighting a war for mental freedom. Are you ready to face torture, insanity, and death? Because this is your last chance to chicken out. Oh, me, sir. I'd like to chicken out, please. Too late, soldier. But you said... There's only one way out of here. Fighting. I want one of you chickens to sock me square in a jaw. I warn you, once you do, the war is on. This guy I obviously said, pop me. has PTSD. I'll stop you. Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go, go! Charge! <laughs> What kind of obstacle course is this? That kid just got killed. A mental obstacle course, you bleeding heart. He's not dead. His astral projection just got kicked out of my mind. And I'll kick your astral projection out of here too if you don't get moving right now. Get, get that stupid fun. Yeah, I'll just... <laughs> <laughs> Just a figment of my imagination. You can run right through figments. They help you rank up, and when you rank up, you earn new psychic powers. So whenever you see a figment, suck it up, soldier. Come on, get that figment. Be a figgy piggy. Hey, well. What are you staring at? We all have emotional baggage, kid. Why don't you make yourself useful? Sort some of it out while you're in here. Keep your eyes peeled for a tag that matches. Could be anywhere. There it is. Now, you will pick up that tag and you will put it on that bag you just found. Unless you'd rather just drop and give me 20 right now. You hit that ladder hard, son. Show it who's hard. hard what? You'll have plenty of time to stand around when you're dead. Now, uh, for those names, you should right there for bags. Oh, we show them in this first level. The rest kind of... Get past this! This is stupid! 
stupid. Hmm. Looks like a test. There's probably a secret, more advanced route. What's that supposed to mean? You think you're more advanced than me, new kid? Sorry, what? I'm not stupid. You're stupid. The coach is stupid. The whole camp is stupid. That thing flying at you is stupid. What's flying at me? Whoa! <laughs> Bobby Dutch's has... foot! That's what? You stupid new kid! Yeah! <laughs> You'll be regretting that noise here in a couple minutes. Oh! <laughs> Thanks for saving me. Well, actually, I was saving this plant. Huh. Never seen one so meaty before. I have. It's been appearing in this creepy nightmare I keep having. You're having nightmares? Oh! I've been reading about how to fix those. Will you let me see one? Hmm. No. Mentalis Uberalis! So. Where's he going? He's He's getting up here. my name. What was that, Slowy? I can't hear ya. You're talking too slow. <laughs> Jack. He found Jimmy. Mentalis Booberalis. I know there's something over here. I just need to find it. Yeah, I'll pick up. I'll pick up. Thank you. Hey, slow down, you kid. If you pass me or Bobby, you'll make us look bad. 
and Bobby will pound you deaf. Bobby, can you hear me? Where are you? Don't leave me alone out here. You'll have plenty of time I'm to frightened. stand around when you're I'm dead. Frightened. Watch those mines, kid. They'll blow you up like a ten cent kazoo. Hey, Dogen, what's wrong? I keep blowing up. I'll help you. Follow, Follow me. me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. Okay. I can't do it! I can't do it! Yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. Okay. He's like, instantly... Alright, I'll follow you. Good, uh... Right here, Dogen. Come on. Right there. Look! No, I have plenty of time to get around when you're dead! Good hustle out there. Hey. Um... This is for helping me out. Okay, bye. Give you three arrowheads you need for buying upgrades and stuff. Alright. Uh, oh, oh my god, I almost exploded. No! Did I get all of them? Is there any more? No? Good. Yep. That just. Yep. Stop the flag. Go. You'll have plenty of time to stand around when you're dead! No one told me to pack a chute. Did Washington have a chute when he crossed the Delaware? Just jump, sissy! Well, I guess we're all going to die. Yeah. My right. whole life is flashing before my eyes. My... Is there like a climax to this story? Didn't I mention the gopher yet? Thought I hit that. Okay, let oh, me no. start over. First, we went to the end of our street, and then we turned left, and then we turned right, and then I gave Lady a bone, and I gave Lady a bone. Woohoo! <laughs> Probably the funniest line I've seen. Hey, look! It's Raz! Yay! Raz is here! Yeah! Maybe oh, you'll no, be sorry. able to beat this to darn game! We can't do it! Sorry. Yeah, we're no good, and the coach won't open the gate until someone wins! Yay! Raz! Just punch that to start! You score enough points on this course, kid, and I'll give you a reward. Kind of reward. Enjoy that. One of my favorites. 
Participation ribbon at the end of camp.
There goes Raz down into this. because I've got to walk all the way back to uh, <laughs> the area. Yeah, there's a bunch
the old rolling tunnel of crazy laws, bitch. An old one, but a hard one. What you gotta do is... <laughs> ah, who are we kidding? You're never gonna make it through that. <laughs> you wanna bet? Oh, wait. Come back! I'm going to spend on this one section, but, uh, oh, no, no, please. Oh, fell, still fell. Yep. Well, I got the one this time, oh my god. the game's not. Um. Who? On this one? It had to be in the log rolling. It had to be in the log rolling. I guarantee it. I'm not going to go into that door. Well, actually, I might have to. I might have to do that. Wait, what? Come on. Come on. Come on. Where? Where? I've missed it. And how many did I miss? That's what I want to know. No, I got all the figments. It just didn't pop up with a little... Okay, then it's just cheesing me. Don't do that. That's not nice. That was the last figment. Just being a turd. Right. Well, let's just over here. A major plot point? Right there, son. Now, just what in the Sam Hill do you think you're doing in there? I was just looking for a way out. Oh, sorry about that. Didn't think you'd get to the end so fast. Dang, I didn't think you'd get to the end at all. You surprised me out there, kid. Here, you've earned this. Your first Psychonaut Merit Badge. But 
I'm always glad to see a soldier come back from the field alive. Now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go back in. I left some good men back there. He crazy. He's got a glass eye too, I think. So. Way to make us look bad in there. And you are in trouble now. Bobby Zilch ain't happy. You better watch yourself, Goggolicious. What's that, hair boy? You want a piece of me? Hey, Brainiacs, settle down. Why? You worried I'm gonna hurt your boyfriend? No, because Sasha Nine is standing right behind you. Your performance, young cadet, was outstanding. I'd like you to report to my lab for some advanced training. Raz the Spaz is gonna be in a special class. Benny, remind me to give him a special beating later, okay? These tests are unauthorized, though, so I can't actually ask you to come. But if you happen to drop in, well, what could I do? Let me just give you this. Remember, your talent will always set you apart, Rasputin. Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. Wait! I don't even know what your lab is! Is this some kind of test? Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. And now I'm hearing things. Great. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I always wanted to try this. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes, right? And then I'm gonna start to count to a hundred, okay? And then you guys hide. Everybody got it? It's hide and seek, Vernon, not hide and calculus. We've all got it. I got it. You start counting, and then I go hide in that bush. Great. What? Milka, you're a genius. Come on, Dogan. Hold on. This reminds me of a story. It's about counting. Hello? Bad. You guys are good. You know, a nutcracker might be faster. Tonight, when this baby is full of fine ladies, I'm going to see everything. How are you going to fill that nut with ladies? No, dude. The girl's cabin. I've got a man on the inside. I get it. You're using clairvoyance. You grabbed one of the squirrel's nuts, and now you're using clairvoyance on it to form a mental link and see what the squirrel sees. Um, could you say acorns instead of nuts if you repeat that to anybody else? Teach me how to do that. Hey, I paid a little bit of attention in class, but not that much. What you need is an expert in clairvoyance, where I am merely an expert in the ladies. I can do that one. On sale now in the main store, we have a special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me? Dream Fluffs! They're yeah, good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for a quick boost of mental health. I know. Always in place. Don't ever not check the place.
Okay, call me crazy, but I have just got to sell more Psycores today. So yes, these prices are real. Here at the camp store, Psycores are just that cheap today. This way. Yes, no, I'm going to end up sight. Guards in sight. Level up. Instant level up. Side challenge mark. Sorry. That's what it was. Side challenge mark. Nine. <laughs> Still on my card. Cardo, where'd you go? Huh. Actually, I know where it is. Yep. Can I grab it? Sasha Nine's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. I did think of that before. That's why I'm here now. Exactly. Now you gotta pay the toll. One arrowhead. Pay up. I found this thing. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. That's an arrowhead. How'd they get here? Frankie, the new kid can't be this dumb, right? The camp's built on an Indian burial ground and... Oh my gosh! Indians buried their dead here? Ew! I hope not. No, stupid. They buried their arrowheads here. They're hidden underground, but they let out a little gas once in a while. Just like Coach Oleander. So if you see any of that stuff, just pull them right out. Like truffles. Anyway, let me have one of yours. Probably want to go buy some dream fluff. Whoa there, you. Come here, you. Can't do the scavenger hunt without a list. Report back to me when you have enough items for your first promotion. Now get! And now I have so to go where back do I... Hey, where'd he go? How does that old guy get around so fast? Fast travels, mate. You know? No? All right, then. I have to go backward and get what I need to get from here. Scavenger hunt. Most of scavenger hunt items I can't get. Basically, rank 
unlocked or uh, to the trampoline of destiny. Open sesame! Oh, wait. Hey, I need that for my scavenger hunt. It looks like it's completely frozen in a big block of ice. Dummy. I'm a dummy, I can't do it yet. <laughs> I had to go. Cycle please, first. Welcome to the Whispering Rocket Underground Rapid Transit System. Would you like to go back to your private sanctuary now, Agent Kreller? Or somewhere else? Let's go to Ford's, I mean, my sanctuary. Let's go to Ford's, I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble Psycho Master. finally meet you in person, sir. I thought I recognized you in my dream, but I couldn't be sure. Now that I see you in your element, there's no doubt. You're Ford Cruller, the greatest leader the Psychonauts ever had. Well, you shouldn't believe everything you read in True Psychic Tales magazine. Um... I'm just gonna do this bottom I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Thanks. I'll need it. Don't worry. I'll be right here with you. Inside your head. My head? Yep. I want to keep my eye on you, son, so I'm going to be a psychic stowaway inside your noggin. If you ever want to make me appear, you can do it with this special device. Is that... Bacon. A piece of bacon? Oh, yeah. I just love bacon. I smell that stuff and I can't help it. I drop everything and come running. Okay. Do you have like a little baggie or something I could put this in? You get a move on or I'll eat that right here. Agent Cruller? Sure. How goes the training? Oh, I I'd really better not. go. Good luck. I really can't move up. Yep. Oh crap. Where would you Let's go Let's Plot go. me outside the main lodge? Oh. Bring me back a burger this time, will you? Seen bear lurking in woods? Yes. Nope. Positive. Giant, hairless bear? Not hairless, nope. but... In Russia, bears much smaller. Also more hair. Less lurking. Always eager to wrestle. This one, hide and run. I'll let you know if I see anything. Cannot lurk forever, bear. Hide and run. I 
up as much money as I can get. You look a strange coin. Hold the blue. Sasha 9's secret lab is? Secret? It's printed on your map. Duh. Oh, I knew that. I was just curious if you knew where Sasha 9's lab was. Because I do. Uh-huh. What you doing there? We're making friendship bracelets. You know, for our friends. So rude. We have one side challenge marker left in this area. 17 side cards left in this area and one scavenger hunt. Remember to keep filling up those scavenger hunt for. Look at those two. Who'd even want a stupid friendship bracelet? I don't know. I wouldn't mind one. Yeah? Well, that's stupid. <laughs> and yet, I don't think she's gonna find stupid later. Oh. Hey, it's the king of the obstacle course! Hey, Rez! You're awesome! You must be a psychonaut by now! Yeah, or even a double psychonaut! Double <laughs> Oh no, not yet. But soon. Wow, those two are so nice. As they're measuring poison. I think they want to kill Raz. I'm not, I'm not really sure. Oh. Double fine, if you're listening. Put these two in the next game and just continue the little will they won't be with killing Raz. <laughs> Please.
P-F-I-R-E song. Eager one. Eager to learn, I wonder, or just eager to play? Sir, I am here to learn, sir. You're here to train hard? Mm. Yes, sir. Develop a skill? Yes, sir. To become part of a noble team? Yes. Yes, to become... Yes. A janitor. Yeah. No. What? I'm here to be a psychonaut. Yeah, there the brainy jub jub goes on upstairs. And down here it's pushing brooms, not bending spoons. <laughs> Like a dumb dumb. Warning, geodesic psycho-isolation chamber this way. Stay out. Stay out? Why would anybody yep. tell you to stay out, Raz? Come on. Come on. Oh, 
many trading cards. Oh my god. Hey, was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. <laughs> mm, no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there, lurking, watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> Lol. Tease. Her. Hey, you're that new kid, ain't you? Well, I'm doing some advanced training right now, as a matter of fact. So I don't think New Kid is really a name that you want to get too used to saying. Well, hold on there. You're not doing Sasha Nine's advanced training that he does in his secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes, I am. Sakes alive. Well, nice knowing you. Get away from the fist to do. That's all I wanted to do. Oh. Oh. 
Yep. People think you need the levitation ability to get in there. That's not the case. Smart about it, you don't need it. That looks like fun. It's work. I'm testing a low orbit space plane design. Oh, that's what you're talking about. Right. So, if you time it exactly right, you can get up there without using it. So. All the people just claim their old guides. Oh, you need levitation to do it. <laughs> I might actually get the frickin' Hierophanesis. Um... Why do I always miss the jumps? Failure. Yep. Uh, no. Well done. Out, mate. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arm. What is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psychoisolation chamber. Oh man, cool! Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six sensory deprivation tank, a hermetically sealed metaphysical hot box. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Bully and dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. Why even cooler? Perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, wait! So... However... Hmm. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. I couldn't... I can put myself in this. To continue on next episode, I think I remember what button it is. Do that! No, not that. Agent 9, I'm here for the advanced training. And we will be doing Agent 9's advanced training. So what are we gonna learn? Bending spoons? Burning stuff? In the next episode. I can I'm just gonna save. We'll come back tomorrow and continue playing. Not even.